Climate change is on a complete collision course right now with civilization as we know it. We've had lots of civilizations collapse in the past from environmental causes. I'm certain climate change has occurred. Our responses at the moment are inadequate in terms of coping with these newly displaced people. These are really the human faces of climate change. Nature is now at war with us. We're going to have to rethink climate change as being some remote environmental issue that the scientists will work out over there. It's so huge. It's so big that's coming our way. It's almost beyond comprehension. We are the same. Human race. No difference. We're dealing with the fact that there's a gap between what the law provides and what the world needs. People cross borders all the time. That will change all sorts of equations. When you get scarce resources, or if you get a change so radical that people can't function, uh, you have huge displacement. The threat of refugees as a consequence of climate change is an enormous national security issue. Europe is spending millions to defend itself against immigration from Africa. When the Pentagon begins to think about what might happen, that's a clear indication that we have to start taking something seriously. This is not a 100-year or 50-year issue, it's a present issue. It already is affecting the price of food you're putting on the table. It will affect the price of energy that you pay for your home and your automobile. We can meet this challenge. We can transition to a low-carbon economy. We can invent our way out of this problem. We ought to be able to come together, not red versus blue, but in a red, white, and blue way. is no longer to save the planet. The challenge now is to save civilization itself. And that is not a spectator sport.